Brittany to be over here. In today's show, we have a story on Blaine Jepson and Emma Dowd signing. I'm Savannah. And I'm Madison, and you're watching SBTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Right now, Schoology has information on several scholarships available, volunteer applications, and job openings at the Boys and Girls Club. If interested, see Schoology. The Curiosity Day will be in the library next Monday and Tuesday, every hour except for 6th. Make sure to come see what it's all about. If you want to join the Writing Center next semester, make sure to stop by Miss Sands' room W7. Applications are due December 17th. Sharp final waivers will be passed out Monday and Tuesday. If you are absent that day, see Mrs. Geis in N14. Waivers will be turned in Friday, December 13th during lunch. Students, if you are planning on riding the bus during finals week, they will not be picking you up until 3 p.m. all three days. If you want to be featured in the holiday light display, please contact Mrs. Riley or drop by C2 to be featured. Let's head over to Savannah with sports after this quick commercial break. What's up guys? It's your guy, Elias Mosier here, and hey, I got a great product for you. It's called SVTV Live Streaming, okay? We want to get this done so we can see all those sports like, go touchdown bowl, man. Like, get a strike, my dude, and golf. Like, you know, these great sports. If you want to see them live, all you got to do is go down and hit that subscribe button. Just smash that subscribe button, guys. Don't forget to turn on that bell notification and like the video. Thanks, guy. See you later. There's an epidemic spreading. Scientists say it can change your brain. It can release dangerous chemicals like formaldehyde into your bloodstream. It can expose your lungs to acrolein, which can cause irreversible damage. It's not a parasite, not a virus, not an infection. It's vaping. Many students have been signing to play college sports. Maddie Steiner will sign to play volleyball at Johnson County Community College during CLP today. Blaine Jepson and Emma Dowd signed this past week. We went to see how those went. Blaine Jepson recently signed with Washburn University as a pitcher. I really liked Washburn. It was one of the first schools that reached out to me and it just meant a lot to me. I really liked the coaching staff there and it was just, uh, I really enjoyed my visit. Got a lot of nice facilities and looking forward to it. Probably pitching in the state championship my sophomore year. Um, just winning state, it's one of the best feelings I've ever had playing baseball. You know, over time, we've been able to prove and play at a high level and, and uh, play championship level baseball. Don't forget to go congratulate Blaine on his recent signing. Congratulations, Blaine. And now we have another story on Emma Dowd signing to McPherson College. And I'm so excited to go to McPherson. So. I'm signing to McPherson College to play tennis and get my bachelor's degree in English education. Uh, reviewed a couple different schools, um, Winfield and McPherson, both were great schools, but McPherson just Hi, felt more home to her. It, it fit her. It fit her really well. Emma, her coach, and parents shared some of their favorite memories. My favorite memory playing is probably my sophomore year. Um, Sarah Latondris and I um, did really good at regionals, and there's a picture that just explains like how happy we were that night. On her junior year, they made it to state, um, and she took 10th at state as a junior. And so seeing her uh, medal, that was probably the best memory that I have of our four years together. Say that I have a favorite. She just always goes out there and tries her best, and she's probably harder on herself than anybody. But she's just a great tennis player and great kid. She works hard at it. With her years of playing, Emma has worked really hard to get where she is today. 
so happy for her and proud that she has moved on to the next level and able to, to, to get a scholarship after all the hard work that she's put in. I'm excited for her. It's what she's worked for and, and it's what she's wanted, so yeah, very excited. Yeah. Definitely going to miss the girls and um, the coaches. Emma is leaving a mark on Seaman High School with player of her class and lettering all four years in tennis. Congratulations, Emma. Good luck, Emma. That's all for sports. Let's head on over to Madison to see what the weather will do this weekend. Hey Vikes, here's your weather. So today's high is going to be 43 and tonight's low is going to be 24. And then here's your three-day forecast. And I'll back over to your anchors. You will see Emory on Monday with your report. Have a good day, Vikes. I hate this chair. No, no!